So in today's a fan Q&A, we're joined by Magic Inofsky. Magic, thank you so much for joining us. How are you? How are you doing? I'm great. Uh, I really miss you guys, so I'm very happy to, to see you. So we've had lots of questions submitted for you on our social media platforms. So let's take a look at what the fans wanted to know. First off, how has the off season been for you? How have you been keeping busy? What have you been up to? Yeah, it's, it's many things around. Um, we still work, uh, work a lot with, with our workshop. Um, many changes, uh, build some new stuff. And uh, yeah, it's, it's always, winter is always busy. Uh, yeah, and I also been for some holiday for two weeks in Mexico. So yeah, winter go very, very quick uh, when I'm busy. So um, uh, if we look now, we have like a little bit more than than uh, one, one and a half months, two months to, to start a season. So yeah, winter, winter is quick, very quick. Definitely. But apart from the Speedway, have you been doing anything else? I know you mentioned your holiday. Have you been taking part in any other sports at all? Um, yes, um, I have, every day I do something fun and, uh, and, and training a lot and uh, yeah, doing some sports. Uh, I go with my friends to, to mountain for uh, mountain bikes and uh, I just wait to. I just wait when when they will open the ski slopes because I really miss my snowboarding. The fans have also seen some fluffy dog faces appear on your Instagram as well. How many dogs do you have? Uh, around my family is many dogs, but uh, actually in our house uh, we have uh, we have three dogs. Um, but uh, yeah, my my brother and his girlfriend have another dog and. It's, it's many of them and a lot of my friends have dogs, so yeah, it's, it's many animals. <laughs> Three dogs in one house, that's that's a lot to take care of. I mean, do they cause a lot of trouble at home? Uh, not really. Actually, two of them two of them are on outside, but only, only one, uh, the, the smallest boss, are in home in my parents' uh, in my parents' uh, house. So. Uh, my two dogs, uh, they are, uh, they stay outside. Uh, we used to travel uh, like a couple times in this winter to the mountain and uh, me and my friends, uh, we used to put some headlights and we go uh, on, on, on night time, um, we go to the mountain and, and, and yeah, walk, uh, walk on the mountain and, and yeah, just, just enjoying the winter. No, that sounds, that sounds absolutely amazing. It's nice to know that we've got another dog person in the Speedway. But the fans wanted to know as well, other than Speedway, what is your favourite sport? My favourite sport? Um, um, I, I follow a lot um, uh, UFC, MMA. Uh, but uh, yeah, I follow also, also football. Uh, maybe not so much motocross and MotoGP, but uh, always when I... Uh, when I have a chance to watch, I always, uh, I always really like it. I think the more, most, uh, most of the time I, I, I watch soccer and um, and uh, UFC. Do you think if you weren't a speedway rider, do you think you could have been a professional in any of those other sports? Uh, hard to say, hard to say. But uh, the way to be, to to be a speedway rider was very, uh, very hard and. Uh, uh, cost many many uh, hours of training so uh, maybe if i will uh, do the same with, uh, with different different kind of sport maybe uh, i can reach some professional level you never know and what is the best rider that you think you've raced against or raced with the best rider um again against for sure uh, uh, Bartek Zmazlik, uh, Dercy Ward, Jason Crabb, Green Craig, oh, there's many of them. There's so it's, many to choose from, isn't there? <laughs> so many of them. I cannot uh, miss any of, you know, very good riders. So um, I, I can say the, the level on the GP uh, series is very high and uh, most of the riders are, uh, are in my nightmare. <laughs> and another tough question for you. 
if you could pick your ultimate lineup to race against in a Grand Prix final, which three riders would you want to race against and why? Yes, I will pick uh, uh, Darcy, uh, Darcy Ward. I will put Greg and maybe Tony Rickards. That's definitely a good choice. I like those three. Do you think you have a good chance against them? Uh, if I jump from the start, maybe I will have a chance. <laughs> And I know you mentioned Greg Hancock. You've got a very close relationship with the Speedway legend. The fans were keen to know what is the best piece of advice that he has ever given you? To, uh, to, do, to never change. Uh, I mean, as a person, uh, don't, get, don't take too many things to my head if I'm losing or if, if I have hard time. How I how I uh, talk with the people and uh, how I see everything around the speedway. Um, it's it's many things because Greg always when we talk, when we have a chance to talk we uh, he always try to give me some good advices. So um, it's always it's always good to talk with Greg. No, definitely. That that sounds like amazing advice, and I think all the fans would be really pleased to know that you have taken that on. You've been you've been so lovely with the fans. You're always really engaging. Excellent in, in autograph sessions as well. Do you still speak to Greg quite a lot? Yes, um, we're still in in, in, con in contact. Greg still ha helps me a lot uh, uh, with my career, and uh, maybe uh, we will have a chance to work maybe even more. So uh, he's still uh, behind my behind my back and uh, still uh, push push me to to get better results uh, every day. Fans also want to know what your favorite track to race on is, but you can't say Roswell. <laughs> so I would say it's uh, Molina. I mean Molina, Molina because that's a very good racing track, couple of good good lines, and I know this track pretty, pretty good, so uh, maybe that's right. And the fans also want to know whether we'll see the blonde hair make a comeback again. Is this something that we'll see resurface in 2021? You never know. That depends uh, how I wake up and the world will uh, stay in my head after my my dreams. You know. <laughs> Is there another uh, color that you're quite keen to dye your hair? Um, you know, I know that's very uh, that's very easy for me to change my hair or make another tattoos. Um, I never think too long about that. That's only uh, only hairs, so I can cut them or. And make them a different color every day so thank you so much for joining us today magic we're really looking forward to seeing you back this season so uh, i just yeah and i want just want to say hello to all the fans and uh, hopefully uh, we we can see a big group of fans on, on the stadiums